Hello everybody and welcome to another factions video here on Eternal Factions and we are finally back after like what like maybe two weeks or something and not recording. I'm sorry I know I was busy I had school and yeah I guess I shouldn't be making too many excuses though you know. I was busy, I had like a final, but yeah. Anyways though, today we got a lot of stuff planned, so I'm very excited to do it because I haven't been on in a while, and there's just a lot of stuff that's been kind of accumulating that I normally do over a whole bunch of episodes that I just kind of want to all fit into one video for you guys to enjoy. Anyways though, I should mention if you guys want to check out my Fortnite videos, there will be a little like exclamation mark in the very top right corner of the screen if you guys want to go check them out that would be greatly appreciated and other than that if you guys do go on to enjoy this video please leave a like down below and subscribe it would be greatly appreciated and other than that I hope you guys all do enjoy the video and let's hop into it all right so I think the first thing we're gonna do is all these crate keys cuz we got five three three and two so I think we're gonna start off with the voting keys 50k I think we, we can try to use that to repair our armor because it's kind of low, not going to lie, especially our helmet. WD kit, that's good. Give me some more E-gaps. Oh. Oh. These things must be worth so much. 91% success rate. Oh, that's so good. Yo, we might have to just sell those on AH. What kit? A U oh. Who just drops a UD kit? Alright then, Chief. And we got an Elite key, which is perfect because we're going on to the Elite keys now. Another- wow. Elite crate gives me an Elite key. <laughs> Master key, alright. XP, I don't really think that's the best. More XP. And a spawner. I like the spawner, that's good. Alright, we got a Turtle G kit. That's decent, I'd say. Necromancer G kit. That's good as well. 175k, I'll take it. And a, another legendary. Alright, so we got two legendary keys. We're gonna open these up. Although, actually, I think it says three. If, I can, if I'm thinking back, yeah, I should. Boy! Necromancer, alright. IGs, two of them. And more IGs. We got four IG spawners. That's actually really good. So we got a whole bunch of stuff from that. I'm not even complaining. We're definitely gonna put away a whole bunch of these kits if we can. Also, I got these forge notes. I really, I think we can sell these like 100%. I'm not sure what the price is for them though. And that's what I'm kind of worried about if I'm gonna under or overprice them. I think we're just gonna quick check the AH if we find, ooh, forge note, all right. Okay, that's really bad, but that's like 100k, so we could probably get a whole bunch for this, not gonna lie. Let's see. 1 million for any- Oh! Alright, I think we might just have this, honestly. Uh, let me ask chat. Uh, 300k, alright. So we could get- what is that, 600k for them? I'd say that's a decent amount. I think I might just keep them, though, not gonna lie. Just because I think you can use them to upgrade custom enchants. And if I'm not mistaken, in my e-chest, I should have custom boots somewhere. Yeah, here they are. We could try to upgrade, like, our gears or springs, which gives us jump boost and speed. Yeah, that'd be really actually helpful. Oh, I'm trying to get the gears 5 and springs 5. I don't actually have a god set because I don't play that much and I really should so I can try to get one. Maybe I might do a live stream just trying to grind for a G set. I think that'd be a cool idea. Tell me what you think. If I were to do it, it'd probably be this Friday. Anyways, we're going to head to the slash wild here and I'm going to grab a kit. Probably just our god and god eater just so we can get like a slime ball as well as like the gapples that come with it. Because that would be helpful. Okay, we got like so many slime balls. So we're kind of set with that. And then... I think... I think we're going to fix our armor right now. Just because I really don't want to have to like fix this mid-battle. Alright, I'm just going to do some mining. I'll cut back once I have a whole bunch of stuff. Because you guys do not want to watch like a 10 minute clip of me just mining and speeding up. A few moments later... 
All right, so we finally finished mining. We got a whole bunch of relics here. I could only find one legendary relic, which is kind of sad, but I got a lot of commons, and I got two of the rare and epic. So hopefully we can get something good out of these. I'm not sure what they give, really, because I haven't opened relics for a while. Actually, I don't know. Did I do it in the last episode? I don't know. I forgot anyway. It's fine. <laughs> okay, voter keys. I'll take it. All right, yeah, we're getting a lot of just keys, which I mean, I'm not even complaining because like they they help us because then we can use them to open up more stuff, which I mean, it helps. Oh, 150 CE EXP, I will take that. I really like that as well. Let me check my CE shop. Oh, we're at 318. We need 1,200. That's a yikes. I think it used to be 800, which is kind of sad that it's not that. We got a god kit and 58 iron ingots. All right. Hopefully these will give us MD kit and more iron. All right. Please, legendary, give me something good. I really want to get like, I don't even know what these give you, but like the best thing that it gives you. I don't know. Ooh, Afro's kit. That's actually good. Not going to lie. We will sell all the iron here. And that should get us a lot more coins. If I check our slash balance, oh, we're at two point, pretty much 2.8 mil, which is actually so crazy. I think we're, we're honestly just gonna level up a whole bunch, but first we're gonna go to slash spawn so that we can also open up our crate keys while we do this and maybe we can get some more money for leveling up. There's people who are at level 62 and stuff, jeez. Wow, okay then. All right, I'm, it's, it's not showing what, how many keys we have, but it's fine. Oh, we got five of those. Wow, along with the uh, one we just opened. Two more forge notes, please. Oh, those things are trash. Oh, a silk touch pickaxe. If you guys don't know what silk touch does, it just allows you to place down a spawner and remine it without losing the spawner. All right, we got one elite and one legendary. We got or we got two master keys now. Necromancer kit, all right. And a pig spawner, or no, pigman spawner. So we got a lot more spawners, which is nice. One of these days we'll set up a like proper grinder. We can just like grind for the CE EXP. And we can do like a massive opening of stuff. I think what we will do actually with these boots here with a whole bunch of the custom enchants, we're just gonna like use the forge notes here. Cause it's like 16% success so it doesn't even matter we shouldn't keep them for like upgrading something good so let's just do slash combine and combine and we'll upgrade I'd say probably gears okay nope it failed I think we're gonna try springs this time maybe we can get better luck no that's kind of sad but I mean it's fine hopefully we can get some sort of upgrade with these but I want to save them for like upgrading from like a tier 4 to a tier 5 that's like something that really matters all right so we're gonna level up quick because we can get a whole bunch of levels out of this and I think no it's slash level hold up I know I know how to do this okay all right here we go I don't know what level we're at but we're just gonna spam this out okay we're level 17 now wow that's actually really great. Uh, what did we get? Oh, wow, we got a lot of stuff here. I'm gonna drop the Titan just because no one even wants it, honestly. All right, so now I'm gonna explain to you guys how I'm able to like farm the relics so efficiently. So basically, even if you you literally can do this if you have literally nothing, because what what you have to do to begin with is you just do slash wild a whole bunch, and then you just find some chests. So let me do this again, and maybe okay, there's nothing in there. Nothing in there. Okay, right here. Now we already found it. Efficiency 4, which is decent. You can keep searching if you want a higher efficiency pickaxe. But essentially, you just gotta try to get a good efficiency. I'd say probably like 5 to 6 is a good amount of efficiency for a pickaxe. And so if you can get some sort of like speed boost, which I have right now, I think. No, I don't. 
I mean, I, th I don't even think you need speed to do this. I, I wasn't doing it previously with speed. And then you just go down here and you just start mining a whole bunch. And then the goal is once you get more, some relics in your inventory, so say I were to get one, say like the armor's relics, then you just place them all in your, your inventory. And so once you have one of every type, you can just mine it. So yeah, there's four. There's common, rare, epic, and legendary. So once you have one of all of those, then you can just keep mining and stuff, and you can let your the rest of your inventory fill up with like cobblestone, say. And you can just keep mining because the if you do collect a relic, it'll just go straight to like one of the relics in your inventory. And yeah, that's how I efficiently farm the relics. When I need to get any. Also, one thing, it is nice to have a home farther away from spawn, so there's more stone to farm other than just on the ceiling right here. But I mean, you, you technically don't have to do that, so it's fine. I think next episode, we're going to set up a base, because I really do need one. My inventory is getting filled. My ender chest is actually already completely filled with stuff. I need a base. Last time I tried to make one, I didn't have slash fly. Maybe I do have it now. I still don't. Honestly, staff, if you're watching this... Please, I, I need fly. I need to make a base. Anyways, though, I hope you guys all did enjoy this video. And if you did, please leave a like down below. And other than that, I will see you guys all in the next episode. Have a wonderful day. Peace out.